am Pachama. I am working as open source developer in Chipkit for past 3 months. Presently, I am going to talk about menu bar controls. The menu bar control displays the top level of menu as a horizontal bar of menu item, where each item and bar can pop up a sub menu. The menu bar control interrupts the data provided in the same way as the menu control and support the same events as the menu control. A menu bar is static, that is, it does not function as a pop-up menu, but it is always visible in your application. Because the menu bar is static, you can define it directly in MXML. Then, creating a menu bar control. A menu bar control in MXML by using MXML colon menu bar tag. Specify an ID values if you intend to refer up a component elsewhere in your MXML application, either in another tab or in an action script block. Then specify the data from the menu bar control by using the data private property. Use an MX colon MXML or MX colon MXML list tab. The following rules in mind. With the MXML tab, you must have a single root road and you set the so root property of the menu bar control to false. Then with the MXML list tab, you define a list of MXML nodes and the top level nodes define a bar buttons. Third one, data private has a label pro attributes, label field equal to at label. Then menu bar control, user interaction. User interaction as the for save menu control. The menu bar control has a focus. The left arrow opens the previous menu. If the current menu bar item has a closed pop up menu, then right arrow opens the current menu. If the pop up menu is a open, the right arrow opens the next menu. Next, I go to explain my coding by using flex filter. I had used four menu one is pile menu, second one edit menu, third one view menu, fourth one is spawn menu. I have given to sub menus name new open save save us edit menu sub menu hot and paste then b menu label go to stay stop research and fonts menu sub menu name font color font size font family i have given the name of this is the attributes so i go to menu bar control tag using id is my menu bar label field is at a label it will get the all values from at label then go to execute the program it will come to this output this is a menu bar control one is file menu is a sub menu new open save savers edit menu cut copy paste view menu go to stop resize and font menu i had used one radio type so you can click this font size, it will come to radio buttons. This is the one of the output. If you have any query, you will contact this mail id pachamuthu.b at gmail.com. My blog http colon slash slash pachamuthu.wordpress.com. Thank you for watching my video. Thank you very much.